homeschooling and working by L.M. Preston. Um, while homeschooling and working while shaping amazing learners. <coughs> I don't know why my voice went like that. Um, so throughout the book you got a variety of things to consider. Like you do, you are given resources and like um, tables of like um, in math, um, this grade area, grade level or grade area should be learning or knowing like this. Um, like you get templates at and at the end you get um, examples, course games, and online resources. So it you do get. Um, different things that go beyond the book to help you it like to me it is mainly u.s based um but some of the topics and things could be adjusted um depending on where you are in the world so like um like up in can like up here in Canada or in, uh, in Australia or wherever so um, it talks about like juggling or um, work and school like teaching your kids um, legal like the legal um, requirements like um, who do you have to report um, like the grades and stuff that your kid um, that is your kid is is going to be um, homeschooled or like the grades and everything um, finding homeschooling groups flexibility um, destination of education like post grade 12 where are they going like are they just going to like jump into like an apprenticeship or a job or like are they going to go to post-secondary Okay, so and like um, what you should consider for like your kids transcript because like um, you are schools keep records of that like um, their like their name date graduation date um, homeschool name address parents phone number um, GPA um, grade earned and a, um, a number of other things and like for the parent places to find reputable work at home job and flexible job opportunities um, create a babysitting co-op um, co-work spaces with childcare so for work at home parents getting out of the house and finding a co-work space to rent can be worth it especially if the place includes or has on-site childcare it can also offer nanny share spaces so while having your kid out of like the public or private school system and doing it at home what are your options if you do want to continue to work Um, so and like the amount of hours that a kid would spend in traditional school um, hours versus like home like um, sixth grade two to four hours homeschooling versus eight hour day at traditional school um, high school four hours a day homeschooling versus eight hour day at traditional school so stuff like that um, documentation notebooks, so keeping everything in one place, um, and keeping logged, keeping track of everything. So, um, test notes, um, camps, learning styles, the type of curriculum you're going to do, because like, depending on what province, territory, state, wherever you are, you are required to learn certain subjects um, by the time you graduate. So like in Ontario, you got 
the four years of English, three years of math. You got um, the you got at least grade nine French, um, a history course, um, gym up until like grade ten, I think gym or some sort of um, gym related course like lift it or something or like I think some courses um, I think my school had um, weightlifting as well um, but yeah so you got it um, if you are considering um, doing this you got to consider what um, you do have to have your kid learn yelling outside it's very you don't need to yell if the person's like right in front of you <laughs> okay but yeah um, toss out activities or actions that waste time um, squeeze in learning during a waste of time so running errands or sitting at a one child's sport practice use the time to do quirk, quick work with the other children um, cooking, car maintenance, so like everyday type of skills. Um, so going from elementary to middle school to high school and then um, post high school. So you do have to prepare for that. Um, does give a few resources as well. Um, And you get like sample plans and um, courses um, that would be learned um, each year or you could add as well. But yeah, it's a, like, to me it seems like a very good resources with a wide variety of topics in it. It's not overly explain it's just here's the thing here's the topic here's what it is and then it moves on to the next thing so um and it opens you up to do your own research of okay what's my district province um wanting for the education so yeah working and homeschooling and working while shaping amazing learners happy readings